Just kidding. Bodice sloper is done before you cut it apart. Take a measuring tape from O Junior right here at the corner of the front and use your flexible tape so you can follow the curve. And you're gonna curve all the way down and you need to know how far it is to midpoint down here on the side seam. And you need to know all the way up here to D. I need a total circumference and I need it broken down to this is what's in front and this is what's in back. Once you have those two measurements or three measurements, I guess, then you can go ahead and separate these pages. Now for me, looking at these pages, what are they still missing? They're missing a grain line. They're missing any kind of labeling other than we have center front, center back, and chest line, waistline, hip line. So we have that labeling, but it doesn't have your name. It doesn't have a pattern piece name. What else? How many to cut? How many to cut? There's no notches in the sleeve or in the center front, center back for construction. There's also no seam allowance. So both of these pieces are gonna need seam allowance. Now, once I have gone through the work to do a geometric, geometric drafting of this nature, I like to keep all this math untouched. So for me, I get a new piece of tissue paper, I lay it over the top, I trace the front, set it aside, I trace the back, set it aside, I seam allowance both pieces individually, and I keep this one untouched, just in case I need to go back and reference something or my math is incorrect. So until I know it works, I don't cut this one apart. Yes? Is your, for the, your front arm, it should be at M Junior. Good question. The front measurement should end at M Junior. And then the back measurement should go from M Junior up to D Junior. And then a total distance. And they should match. Front and back added together should match overall. Now, the only other thing the book has us do on this is it has us adjust the waistline down here on the front of the sloper and drop it about an inch. I have never found this necessary because this is a huge square box on a body. If you are really busty or if you have a really large belly, you might want to add this down in the bottom. And it would just be an inch down here and it would just curve and swallow tail. That's the only thing they're adding. I have not found this necessary. And if it is necessary, we figure that out and fitting. It doesn't have to be done at this point. Does that make sense? Okay, you ready for me to erase this? What is the, sorry, what is the distance of this whole thing that should match up with? Again. Your arm's eye circumference. It should be in the ballpark like six, of your arm's eye circumference measurement. Your what? Three and a half inches off it. This one's big? That It's okay if it's big. Oh, okay. Because that just means how much comfort you have here. Okay. So big is good. If it's too small, we've gone wrong. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> 